What up, Team Motivation? It's your boy, MB, in the place to be. Now, today, I need you guys' honest opinion again, right? Okay, five the shop. You know, I never had a shop that big, you know? So me and my partner, George, is wondering, you know, if we can get the YouTube world to let us know what all y'all think we should put in there. You know, barbershop, uh, t-shirt shop, speed shop, uh, you know, we just trying to figure out some things to put up there because like I said, we got a lot of space and um, we're going to show y'all some more updates on we building the um, the display cabinets, uh, cleaning everything out, uh, you know, we new tools, everything going to be brand new. But right now we just got an issue of like what all should we put in that place. So if you guys can give us some ideas of what you guys would do if you guys had that much space, you guys see how big the shop is and if you don't know how big it is, check out the video. It's pretty big. It's two. It's two to three parts actually, with two upstairs. So over ten thousand square feet. So um, like I said, if you guys can just give me some ideas of what we should put in there. Should we put an RC store where we selling drones and like it's so much stuff we can put in there. So if you guys can give me a little, little bit of uh, information on what I should do or what would you do. If you had all that space, what would you guys do with it, you know? Because uh, like I said, I never had that much space, and we want to fill it up because we paying for all the space, so we got to fill all that space up. So you guys let me know what you think. I'm thinking about like a little auto mall, you know what I'm saying? Like a little auto mall or something, you know? So um, you guys let me know what you think, and I'm going to be giving you guys footage of uh, all the work that I've been doing at the house, too, same time. But like I said, the grand opening coming, we, we having a grand opening, a big grand opening. It's going to be different. It ain't going to be like a regular, like how I did when I used to have my shops open up. And now nah, we're going to have a grand opening with party, party. Well, not a party, but, you know, free giveaways, food, uh, you know, just fun, you know. So you guys, look at these guys driving crazy this morning, man. So you guys let me know what y'all think. And what can I do? And what should I do? What should we do in this situation? You know, we got all that space, like daycare. No, we <laughs> no damn daycare. Um, but yeah, y'all let us know what we should do. All right, with that being said, peace and love. I'll catch you guys on the next one. I'm headed to Home Depot right now to grab some materials so I can show y'all the other stuff I got going. And finally putting that paint on that Malibu tonight. Finally putting it on there, like I said, uh, I had a few uh, things. I found some more dents and stuff like that. But, you know, like I didn't want to spray it. I could have sprayed it. I could have been sprayed it. But it's a good thing I didn't spray it because, um, you know, it, it needs to be uh, uh, hitting certain places on that door. And same time, we painting that, uh, the, the, that candy blue. What this guy doing? This guy. The candy blue uh, Monte Carlo, we was trying to put the chrome pieces on there. Without all the tracks, I mean, without the pieces that go in there, and kind of scraped it up a little bit. So I got to shoot that part over. So I'll catch you guys on next one. I got a lot of fiberglass, part two of the fiberglass. Well, part three of the fiberglass. So you guys stay tuned. Peace and love. Y'all let me know what's up with that. Uh, what all should I put in this store, man? Let us know, man. Just let us, give me some ideas, man. Give me some ideas. All right, peace and love.